over the course of the history of Sage Presence, we've done a lot of work that from one perspective looks like it's very different because it has worked with very different kinds of people. But from another perspective, it's very consistent. So we've worked with individuals who are looking for their next job. And we've done a lot of work with organizations that are looking to land their next project. So it boils down to being able to communicate your value. And it also boils down to building relationships with the kinds of people that you want to work with. And it seems to me that that the tail end of that second thing that I just said is kind of, it's really important and it's under-recognized by people looking to get hired and for organizations looking to land a project. It's really easy for people and organizations to fall into the mentality of, I don't care what it is as long as it's work. <laughs> or maybe it's, I don't care who we're working for as long as it's work that we can invoice for or that they'll 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 pay for. And when that happens, it changes the nature of the work from something that you are excited about doing, something that you want to do, something that you feel really capable of doing, something that you're that you feel like you're uniquely fitting and it turns it into a job. It turns it into a transaction, which really kind of drains away the meaning for you as the person providing the work. So what I'd like to suggest is that you as an individual professional or you as an organization, or you as a leader inside of an organization, you start to ask yourself the question, who do we really want to work with? Who is an ideal client? And if you are an individual, you can think of your employer as your client. Who do I want to help? Who am I uniquely situated and positioned and qualified to help? When you think about it like that, then you can start to look for clients that fit that mold. And you can start to qualify projects as something you really want to sink your teeth into, something that will, will get you out of bed every morning and get your team together, excited to provide the service that you exist to provide. When you can get into that mentality, then it almost doesn't really seem like work anymore. It just feels like a fulfillment of who you are. Give that a thought. Let us know what you come up with. We'd love to hear what you experience. <laughs>